Oops. Hey guys, we are on day 16. I'm going through the guitar tracks that I took last night and going to mix them in and then start on string work and drum work. <laughs> My voice is giving out. <laughs> string work and drum work for um, the end of Black Sands. I'm definitely feeling the strain. <sighs> I can get it done though. It's 10 o'clock. four tries to play the same fucking thing over and over and over again. And it's MIDI. It's not like I can't go back and change this, but no, I have to know that I did it. Oh, it's pretty. That would be cool. What did I just do? I am sitting in my living room. Figured a change of scenery would be nice and um, it is just a little past 10, which I always do these at 10 o'clock. I don't know why. Um, I always feel like it's right at the end of the night when I'm almost done. Uh, to catch you up on what I've been doing, but um, doing, 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 doing. If you were on my Twitter or Instagram today, you saw that we finally announced the big news. I will be scoring the film Good Kids, uh, which is written and acted in by my good friend Michael Ridley. We've been wanting to announce this for a few weeks. We've been, uh, I've already started on it. Um, I actually started writing in the middle of uh, doing this album. It's just great that I get to be a uh, part of such an incredible project. I, I cannot wait for you guys to see this film. So as soon as the album is done, next week. I'm going to be starting on that. So um, this is my first film that I've ever scored. Uh, since I was a kid I've been dreaming about doing this. So I hope you guys will stay with me on this journey the next few months. Hopefully I will vlog some things. Um, wouldn't make sense not to uh, because Michael and anyone related to this movie is basically is in Colorado. So I'm probably going to fly out there at least once. So um, I will do a video for that. But for now that is all that I'm giving you. Maybe I can... You, this a... Uh, kitty. This isn't... This isn't working. You're gonna have to get out of here. How am I supposed to work when I only have one arm? You just don't give a shit, do you? Nope. Hey guys, we are on day 20 of making the album. We are at the end officially of week three, and uh, I know I didn't make a video the past couple of days, it's Sunday, but it is my birthday weekend, so I went out of town for a couple of days with my sisters, and um, we had a really great time. But, uh, so I haven't been working on it. And I also realized that all the videos I took this week, I had the camera on manual focus, and it was very, very out of focus, which I don't know how I didn't notice that. Um, I'm so sorry that all the videos before this are going to be extremely out of focus, but I've got it figured out now. We have it under control. I'm really excited about this album. At first, I was very, I didn't know 
what it was going to be, um, which I think always happens. You just kind of have to throw the paint at the wall and then it'll make sense. That's the kind of person I am when it comes to writing. Once I got everything out, then it kind of made more sense uh, what I needed to talk about and what was bothering me. So in that way, this album has been very therapeutic and I can't wait for you guys to hear it. I will see you the next few days, not tomorrow, but the day after, and then we will get back to work. So I guess I will see you in a couple days. Bye guys. Hi guys, it's Shelby here. We are on day 22 of making the album and it, it's week four technically, but I'm just gonna continue this in week three, which you're watching right now. I don't know why I'm explaining this, but uh, in hindsight, I, I, I'm explaining this to myself in out loud, to myself, by myself. Yesterday was my birthday and I updated the studio. Yeah, so no more clutter, no more crappling everywhere, everything's organized, and that is what makes my heart happy. So, um, today I'm going to be doing vocals for Black Sands, and then mixing, and then uh, we'll see what else I get into tomorrow. Um, and then the album should be sent out, and then it will be in your hands a week from today. But you don't, you don't want to look in that corner right there, because that's where all the crap is... Um, stacked so let's just look at the let's just look at the nice new clean organized uh, area of the studio not the crap corner I'm going to finish mixing up a couple things before I start vocals and then I will pull you guys back in and we will get on that and they, and they say I I'm trying to hold on And you say That I'm on my way Oh god, I'm getting sick Not the good kind of sick Dry I think that's fucking start over Um, you can do that better. And darkness come. Suck me in for the night. Paint pictures in my head of the daylight burning bright. Gotta love the pen trick. It works every time. No point in trying to direct your peas and editing it out. It's a nightmare. Just get a pen. Get a pen for your peas. That's... There you go. This take is going on my Instagram right now, so... Um, so you know when this one's happening. Paint pictures in my head Of the daylight burning bright Good job, Shelby. That was a great take. Thank you, Shelby. You're welcome, Shelby. Did a great job there. Zai! <coughs> okay, let's just take a second. I'm congratulating myself on a great take and then, nope, this is terrible. Usually when, like, most artists would be doing their vocals, they'd be, like, super serious and in this mindset. And I find that the more upbeat and positive and goofy I can be with it, the better I do. Because it, it, it's like, if I do a bad take, bad take, bad take, and then I'm just like, oh, I'm horrible, I'm just going to do terrible the whole time. So, you got to give yourself a pat on the back and, and, you know, give yourself some positivity. If it's not fun, there's no point in doing it. It's like, I could sit here and be super serious, but they're going to suck, you know? And this is going to be miserable. And nobody likes that. And darkness come. I'm just losing it. It's okay. It's okay. And darkness come. I've lost control of. <laughs> Why is it always comical when I mess up right there? Because it's saying I lost control of, and then I fuck up. I just keep every time I do it. I just want to say I've lost control of my vocals or something. I can do it better. I can do better. To, to your nose, to your nose. Shit. <laughs> God! In darkness come. I'm not gonna get it. Okay, we're gonna quit there. 
I'm gonna go make more tea. We are only halfway through the freaking song, so I will see you later. That's probably all I'm gonna show of this. I don't want to spoil too much of the song, which I've been kind of doing with everything, but you know, if you're watching this video, you, you deserve it. You deserve something for watching this. I will see you later. Hey guys, we are on the very last day. Um, it is day 23, and today I am finishing up harmonies and like layering vocals and everything. I have all my um, main vocals uh, edited out, so I'm just laying over the last little touches. And it's the last song that's going to be on there. There's only going to be four songs. I've been calling it an album, but what I've meant to say this entire time is EP. So the track listing, not in order, um, will be the remaster of Army of One, a new one called Grounded, remaster of one that I put up on my SoundCloud forever ago called Oracle, um, which is where the name of the album came from. And then the last song is Black Sands, which I started brand new. I worked on Tulpa too, but that song just didn't get finished. It didn't work. I tried working on two other ones, uh, starting two other songs, and they didn't work either, which is, you know, naturally the process. I guess the whole point of telling you guys this is that, um, usually start to finish for me on a song, coming up with the concept, writing the song, recording the song, doing vocals, mixing, um, mastering that whole process minimum for a song for me it takes about two weeks so uh, I've done Black Sands in about a week so I was really hoping to have more songs on this EP I was hoping to have one more but it just didn't happen um, I just ran out of time okay guys it is the end of the last day and uh, the last song has been finished it has been a very fun rewarding three and a half weeks uh, I want to say thank you to everybody that is written in to support or has watched my Instagram videos or commented on these videos. Uh, anybody that just paid attention or gave their support, you know, um, I'm extremely thankful. Uh, this wouldn't be anything uh, if you guys didn't show your support. So uh, again, you guys, you really don't know how much that it means to me. Um, from a year ago when I first put out uh, When the Darkness Comes and got involved with the Maze Runner, uh, I feel like that's when everything started for me and when I started to figure out who I am and what I wanted to do and what I wanted this to be. It's just crazy. And I've never talked about this before, but you spend years trying to figure yourself out and do everything right and nothing works. And then the moment you say screw it and just do what you want, it's crazy how fast things click. As soon as I put out that first song, um, it was like everybody got who I was and I, for once, kind of felt like I knew who I was, so um, I've never said that before, so thank you guys for everyone that has supported me. I'm just gonna stop there, I'm gonna end up crying or getting all emotional. So I am going to go have myself a little mini celebration and I will see you guys on Tuesday. Oracle, September 15th. Thank you guys for watching.